Today I'm going to show you how to make a little cardboard house. What you'll need is cardboard, which I took from boxes like that, something to cut it with, either scissors or an X-Acto knife, a mat to cut it on, and a metal ruler. You also need masking tape and some glue. So I've taped my pattern down to the cardboard and I'm just going to use my X-Acto knife and metal ruler to cut along the line. I'm going to stand up for this because you really want to put a lot of pressure both on the metal ruler and on the knife blade. And the ruler guides the blade and make sure you get a really straight line. And you want to use a very sharp, a new blade because it's going to cut a lot easier than a dull blade. You want to press down because as you can see I'm going through both the pattern which I printed on paper and the cardboard. And this cardboard is very strong. If you'll notice it has ridges in it and when you cut you want to cut down with the lines and not across them. I, you can see I've lined up my pattern the same way the ridges are going and that just helps keep your structure strong. And you'll notice these uh, lines that aren't dashed. These are fold lines. I'm going to show you how you want to score these lines so that you can fold the cardboard later on those lines. And you're not really cutting all the way through. You're just scoring the cardboard. And then when you take the pattern off, you can see if you cut all the way through. And I missed a little spot back there. I just want to release that. And that should be fine. And then when you fold uh, on the fold lines, I find it helpful to use like an edge of something. Just make sure that it bends where you want it to bend. You can see our little house starting to take shape. And then you just want to form it like that and kind of make sure that it's squared off like that. And then you'll take some of your glue I like this glue. It's a nice tacky glue. I'm not going to use it straight from the bottle because uh, you can get too much on and I just really want a little bit right, right here. here. And then take your masking tape and tape it there while the glue dries. Make sure that's all squared off and I've already cut my roof. So I'm going to do the same thing. I'm just going to apply a little glue. On each edge. I'm going to put my roof on. And I want to look through it like this and then kind of see 
you know, is your roof even on both sides? And then you just want to take your tape and tape that down. And then that glue should dry in a couple minutes and it'll be ready to go. And there you have it. A little cardboard house.